Hey everyone, this is Nerdy Devil Dog. And today we'll be doing a quick video showing how to swap the cylinders on the Ruger Single Six. Um, so before we do that, obviously we're going to cover our safety rules. Their acronym for which is Treat Never Keep Keep. Two different weapons if they're loaded. Never point your weapon at anything you don't intend to shoot. Keep your finger straight off the trigger until you're ready to fire. And keep your weapon on safe until you tend to fire. So, going over this revolver the way that we would check it. So we just open this hatch here, pull the hammer back, and rotate the cylinder. We'll just go through it a little bit. Looks like it's clear. We're ready to start switching the cylinder there. So to do so, what you're going to do is you're going to press this little button here. To press that, and at the same time, you're just going to pull this rod out here. So it'll look something like this. At which point, we're going to open this hatch here again and just pull the cylinder out just like that. So this is our 22 Magnum cylinder. We're going to switch it out here for our 22 long rifle cylinder. To do so, you're just going to make sure they have this side going into the back. Just kind of put it in as such. Close the hatch there. At which point we're going to press this button again. Make sure it's seated properly. Put the rod back in. And then I like just rotate the cylinder again. Make sure it looks all right. And just like that, you switch the cylinder from the 22 mag to the 22 long rifle on the single six, the Ruger single six.